Hey there, guys. I'm Cerise Fairfax. Thank you so much for joining me. Well, I got to tell you, I've been watching Justin Bieber for a few years because I really do like the kid. He is talented. He's Canadian, like myself, and he's also very successful at what he does and what he is gifted in. So, of course, I thought, let me pull some cards on him at this new album that's out and also the unstable relationship he seems to have with his wife, Haley. So, let's first touch on some of these cards. Let's look at the past of Justin. That's going to be the left card. So in the past, when it came to relationships, he felt like he was down and out. He felt like he was following behind someone, someone that had a lot of passion for life, but someone who was also going through battles as well with challenges and trials and tribulations. So I'm assuming that the past relationship has something to do with Selena Gomez and him walking along behind her. At times he felt broken. At times he felt like he had a headache, like he didn't know how to keep up with her or, you know, their, their relationship was very intense. And now presently he is at a point in his life where he is growing. That's the middle card. He's growing. He's feeling much better. He's feeling more at peace. He's seeing that his the fruits of his labor are growing as well. And he has a lot more of emotional calm. He's not so emotional. He's trying to find the land beneath his feet. He's trying to balance himself and become more aligned with life. And then the last card right there shows that his ideas will bring him a lot of success, a lot of financial wealth, and the dry land that he's looking to maintain and stand really boldly on will happen. It looks like it's going to take about another month for him to very get himself very much into a position of strength. And then it's going to take him a year to understand what his relationship is with Haley. Let's pull some cards on Haley now. We have them. Let's pull the past, the present, the future. Ooh, they actually have a matching card there in the thread of these cards, but let's just get to the past. That's the far left. So in the past, when it came to relationships, she was pretty much on board with what she wanted. She knew she wanted to be a queen. She knew she wanted to be married and have children one day and just be very happy with one man. And that's exactly what happened with Justin Bieber. But presently speaking, she is now going through a lot of changes. She's wavering a little bit. She's thinking about life. She's, her emotions are running high. And also, she's feeling like she needs to be aligned. She needs to be balanced. She's doing a lot of prayer. She has a lot of faith. But she is worried right now about her relationship. Let's look at the far right. And that's going to be the future. She will make changes in the future. She will get herself to a point of feeling a lot more stable and secure. She will make sure that the relationship with her and Justin Bieber will grow. But when it does break apart, she will feel like there's nothing much she can do. And she will find new love. Children is something that she's focused on right now and it's something that she does want to have but she's also just a little bit nervous because she wants to make sure that she takes her child into a stable environment let's pull some cards on the past present and future of their relationship here we go the past the present the future okay so in the past, when it came to their relationship, both of them were trying to achieve the same thing. They were working together. They have a spiritual connection. And that really helped them in the past with their religion, their relationship, everything. It helped them to remain in love and balance together. Currently, the relationship is 
strong. But Haley is worried. Haley's thinking a lot about her work, her job, what she needs to get done in order to make herself more stable. Because with the release of Justin's new album, that's doing quite well, especially with the hit single, Peaches. She's looking at him like, "Uh uh-oh, now he's going to start doing a lot more without her. You see, in the past, their relationship was working a lot together. Right now, the relationship is more focused on work. That's Justin Bieber focusing more on his album and the album sales, the promotion of it, and also getting it out into the world with performances. Justin is more focused on work than he is right now anything else. And she feels that. She's also focused on her own career. She doesn't want to just become a wife of Justin's. She too wants to be famous. She feels like her career has somewhat subsided, even though she's still modeling and doing everything she needs to get done in her life. She's looking more to the future as what more can she do with herself? She's quite young. So her mind is also focused more right now on career. She is focused again on babies, but she wants to make sure that the situation is ideal. That's their present situation in their relationship. In the future, they're going to have a tough time. They're going to have a lot of brawling back and forth. It's going to take anywhere from five months to five seasons. So you're looking at about a year and a little bit more, a year and four months for the five seasons for some revelations to be made about their relationship. They will reveal that they may break up. So the cards are also saying that they will go through this for quite a while. They've probably already been going through it. Haley gets frustrated a lot with Justin. Justin gets frustrated a lot with Haley. The two of them are very young. They got married very young. And let's face it, Haley wanted Justin for a very long time. And she got him at a time of vulnerability. He's no longer vulnerable. So now he's going to move on and he's going to focus on his work and it will be the work that will get involved with their future and it will make them eventually break up. Well guys, sorry for the Haley and Justin Bieber fans out there. I got to tell you, the cards are not looking good for them. For more readings, please contact me. You can leave your comments below. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for watching.